parents don't hear from the kids for 30 minutes. They lost them in the supermarket. They're getting terrified. The last time we heard his voice was on October 6th. The next day, everything changed as Hamas militants killed around 1,200 people and took hundreds of hostages in an attack on Israel, including 22-year-old Omer Nutra, who grew up in New York, as well as another young hostage, Hirsch Goldberg Polin. 23-year-old Goldberg Polin was one of six hostages whose bodies were recently found in Gaza, something that isn't lost on Omer's parents. We were devastated. You know, we've become very close to the family. We could feel the release so close. Orna Nutra tells Fox 5 at the Republican Jewish Coalition in Las Vegas, a deal had been on the table for months, and Goldberg Poland was supposed to come out of it in the first phase. It's not going to be easy. It's a terrible deal. But the lives of these many hostages are on stake. They could be shot dead any minute. Because of that, they're calling on lawmakers to move the needle. They say while Israel is moving too slowly, they are getting support here in the states. We've seen commitment to this issue from both sides of the aisle. We think people understand this cannot become a political wedge. This is a humanitarian crisis. While she wants those sides to talk, there isn't much to say to those who took her son. I have no conversation with them. Instead, his parents describe how they're holding out hope they'll get to see him again, in spite of not knowing for sure if he's still here. We don't, but we can feel him. We have to believe that, because we don't know otherwise. I'm Sean Dowling, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.